On October 30, 2024, Rafael, the Israeli defense company, announced a significant milestone in U.S. military air defense capabilities. The U.S. Marine Corps successfully completed its first live-fire exercise utilizing a prototype system integrated with Rafael's Tamir Interceptor, part of the renowned Iron Dome Air Defense System. This collaborative effort between Rafael and Raytheon, the prime contractor, involved a sophisticated integration of an American radar and command and control center with a Tamir Interceptor and a mobile launcher, tailored specifically for the Marine Corps. During the live-fire exercise, Marine operators demonstrated the system's effectiveness in intercepting various targets, showcasing its ability to counter an extensive range of threats, including cruise missiles, unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs, and multiple types of rocket artillery. The successful execution of continuous launch operations confirmed the mobile launcher's readiness for sustained defense, an essential capability in modern warfare. This exercise follows a rigorous training and testing regimen as part of the Marine Corps' medium-range intercept capability, MRIC development program. The MRIC aims to enhance the Marines' medium-range interception capabilities, crucial for addressing evolving aerial threats. Moshe Patel, head of the Israel Ministry of Defense's Israel Missile Defense Organization, IMDO, emphasized the operational successes of the Iron Dome, highlighting its vital role in Israel's ongoing Operation Iron Swords. He expressed support for deepening cooperation with the U.S. military in air defense initiatives, underlining the adaptability of the Iron Dome system in various defense scenarios. Shlomo Tov, executive vice president and head of Rafael's Air Defense Systems Division, reiterated the importance of this exercise in the ongoing partnership between Rafael, the U.S. Marine Corps, and Raytheon. He acknowledged the collaborative progress made in developing effective air defense solutions tailored to counter diverse aerial threats. The Live Fire exercise is part of a broader air defense modernization initiative by the U.S. Marine Corps, focusing on the MRIC program and the Marine Air Defense Integrated System, MIDES. In August 2023, the Marine Corps made a strategic decision to purchase three Iron Dome air defense batteries from Israel for approximately $200 million. This agreement includes 44 launchers and 1,840 Tamir interceptors, designed to bolster defense against threats such as cruise missiles, drones, and rockets. Raytheon will play a critical role in manufacturing with parts of the production taking place in the U.S. to ensure interoperability with American systems. The integration of the MRIC with U.S. command and control frameworks will enable the Marine Corps to deploy this advanced capability, especially in the Indo-Pacific region. The MRIC initiative, which integrates key elements of the Iron Dome system, plans to deploy three batteries equipped with Tamir interceptors. For FY25, the Corps has allocated $111 million for these batteries with initial fielding expected by the end of the fiscal year. The MRIC system will enhance situational awareness and interoperability within the Marine Corps' air defense framework by incorporating the ground-slash-air task-oriented radar and the Common Aviation Command and Control System. In addition to MRIC, the Marine Corps is actively expanding its MIDES counter-drone capabilities. Contracts worth up to $200 million each have been awarded to Invariant Corporation and Endural for the development of a counter-UAS system addressing low-altitude threats. MIDES is anticipated to achieve initial operational capability by early FY25, with deployments planned for the 3rd Littoral Anti-Air Battalion of the 3rd Marine Littoral Regiment stationed in Hawaii. The total air defense budget for the Marine Corps has increased significantly to $370 million for FY25, up from $250 million in FY24, enabling further investments in MIDES and additional air defense systems. This successful live-fire exercise marks a pivotal step in the U.S. Marine Corps' journey toward operationalizing its first MRIC battery, reinforcing the focus on enhancing air defense capabilities through strategic partnerships with Israel and industry collaborators. These ongoing initiatives collectively aim to equip the Marine Corps with robust defense solutions to address the complexities of modern aerial threats, ensuring readiness and resilience in diverse operational environments.